everyone, I'm Colleen Ballinger. If you just clicked on this video for the first time, hello, welcome to my channel, welcome to this video. You are about to see me try on some weird, some pretty, some cute, some disgusting wedding dresses. If you've already seen this video and you're confused as to why it got deleted and now it's being re-uploaded and now I'm talking to you, I'm about to explain that right now. If you don't wanna sit through that explanation, you can click to watch the video at this time code. But for those of you who wanna know what the heck is going on, because apparently a lot of you are really upset on Twitter when the video got deleted, here's the explanation. Basically, YouTube now has a lot of new regulations and rules in order to keep a video up on YouTube and to make it be successful. Well, YouTube found something wrong with my video trying on wedding dresses and they decided to demonetize the video and limit the video. If you post a video and it's made for children, they'll demonetize it, they'll limit your video, they'll hide the video, they'll take the comments off the video. If you upload a video and it's too mature, too adult, they'll demonetize your video, they'll limit your video, and you'll basically get penalized, okay? So if you're somewhere in between, which is where I am, you can still do things, say things, act certain ways, do certain things that will punish you essentially and make it so your video is limited or demonetized and that's what happened here YouTube found something wrong inside my video and they decided to demonetize it and limit it this has happened to me in the past and when it does happen to me the video kind of becomes a dead video it doesn't get very many views it doesn't get very many shares it doesn't get very many clicks and it obviously makes no money in the past when this has happened to me I've just kind of been like oh well that happens that sucks moving on but this video I worked really really hard on it took me weeks to make it's I spent over a thousand dollars on the dresses I don't really want this video to be a dead video so I'm doing an experiment re-edit it and re-upload it and see what happens. This could be a horrible experiment and no one could watch this video and oh well, but at least I try. Or it could do well and you guys all watch it and you like it and you comment and do all the things and it's a success. And this is something I could do again in the future if YouTube decides that they hate another one of my videos. So, <laughs> so without further ado, here's the video. But before I get started, I just wanna say one last thing. Make sure to vote on what your favorite dress is because I might wear it when I do my wedding party with Eric later this year but also vote on your least favorite dress because whatever is your least favorite dress, I've decided I'm going to wear for a full 24 hours. Everywhere I go, Taco Bell, Target, to bed, I will wear the ugliest dress that you guys have chosen for a full 24 hours. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being patient with me. And thanks for being my friends that I can vent to when weird things happen with my job. Bye guys, have a great day. Hey guys, it's me, Colleen Ballinger, and behind me, our boxes of wedding dresses. I'm so excited. You guys recently saw me order a bunch of dresses on Amazon. Yes, you can order wedding dresses on Amazon, which blew my mind. So I made a video ordering all of my favorite gowns on Amazon. You guys watched it, you liked it, and now I'm going to try on these wedding dresses. So right now I'm just gonna take them out of the box and out of the packaging and hang them up so that they can kind of like hang and dangle and get out the wrinkles and whatnot, and I'm gonna let them chill for like a day or two, and then I'll put them on, but I had to film me opening them up because I have a feeling it's going to be really funny how none of these dresses look anything like the pictures. Okay, I'm so excited. This one looks small. I'm nervous these are all gonna be just such a hot mess. Here we go, the first one. Ooh, it's a short one. Oh, this is actually, oh my God, there's like black smudges on it already. See this? Like black smudge on the dress already. I, you guys watch, I just took it out of the package and it already has a black smudge. It's also see-through, but you know, maybe that's cool. It looks like you should be uh, goddesses from Hercules. Like, that's awesome. Yes. <laughs> It? This one is obviously not white. I bought a couple options that were like blush or off-white or whatever. So this one. Oh my god, the boob pads. <laughs> this one, it has a little bit of a train. It said it was blush, but it's actually more like skin color. Like it's literally the color of my skin. But you can see just boob pads in it. Not even trying to hide. Like the pads that get crumpled up when you buy a cheap bathing suit. Do you like this one? It's great. You think it's great? Oh my. Here's this one. This one feels heavy. It feels like good quality. So it has like lace on the top and the bottom is like different ruffles. This one's kind of a good one, I feel. I mean, it's not gorge, but it's pretty good. The back is cute. It has like buttons on it and it's like a see-through lace, but it's very wrinkled. This packaging of this dress looks fancy. So this one might've been the more one of the more expensive ones, like close to the $100 range. <gasps> oh my God, I love it. It was very poofy in the pictures. This one's pretty. Well, I have to say in the picture, it was very poofy and it's 
not very poofy in real life. I bought a petticoat, so hopefully that will help poof these out when I'm ready to poof them. I know Corey's still giving me a dirty look. <laughs> this one might be bad. Ew, why is it like off color? It's, oh my God, it says stain. There's a sticker on it. <laughs> I told you. There's a sticker on it that says stain. There's a little stain right here. Why does it say stain? Why would they ship it to me like that? They forgot to take that off because there literally is a stain right here. It was cheap, so that makes sense. Oh my God, I love that it has a sticker on it. I bet it was so that like someone could see it and they knew to fix it before shipping it out and they just didn't. This one smells like fish. Corey, smell this. Oh, Colleen. It smells like fish. Oh, it stinks. It's like flooping the fish smell as I turn it inside out. This one uh, was another one that in the picture was like really poofy. So this one has like a sparkly belt and it smells like fish and lace on the bottom of the fishy tool. Girl, this one stinks so bad. I like the fish smell. Uh, you would. Okay, here's another one that said was like a blush color but it's actually more of the color of like skin. I don't know about those. <laughs> that is mother of the bride. That is mother of the bride, central. Okay, this looks like it's a veil. Okay, so this feel is actually kind of cute. It has like sparklies on the trim. So you put it on like this, and then you go like, yeah. Ooh, this one looks satiny. It looks so weird. What is this? Oh, I think this is the one when I saw it online, Eric said, is that a lamp? I'm pretty sure this is the one that Eric said, is that a lamp? Next. This one is like a 50s style one. This looks like a show curtain. Yes. This is hideous. This looks like our show curtain. It's the same material and the same shape. I think this is another veil. One more, guys. And I have one more coming in the mail tomorrow or the next day, but I just wanted to let these hang. Oh no, this is the mermaid style. Okay, the only other things I bought were like diamond D belts. So I got this little belt and this one. This is pretty. This is very exciting. There are all the dresses and in a couple of days I'm gonna try them all on. So I'll see you guys in a couple of days. Okay, today is the day I'm doing it. I was waiting for one more dress to arrive that's really funny and amazing, but I just got a notification that it's not gonna arrive for like seven more days, so I'm not waiting that long. I'm trying on the ones that I have, and eventually I'll try on the other one when it gets here, but whatever. I'm gonna try these on. My mom is here, my dad is here, Corey's here, Eric's here, the baby's here, and Gus is here. He's coming, Gus has arrived. Are you going to watch? He's ready. Let's get started. Okay, love you. You guys take out the first one. This one. That's just an underskirt. You want a poofy <laughs> one first? We can do a poofy one first. Yeah, go poof. Okay, here's. I think this one's poof. We've chosen the fishy one. This one smells <laughs> like fish. Mom just was sewing me up, and I was like, Oh, this smells like fish. <laughs> Do I say anything? Oh wait, no. Dress. What's that, May? Oh my God, this one is pretty. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, pretty. Oh my God, wait, why is it pretty? Gorgeous. Fishy couture is giving me everything. Wait, this one's pretty. Ready? Gotta complete the look. Okay. Oh my god. Wait, I think this one's pretty. That one is a winner. This is so I can't believe Amazon! This is not an ad or a sponsorship, but like it should be because I think everyone should buy their wedding dress on Amazon now. <laughs> this one was re this is gorge. One out of ten, what would you get? Beautiful. I don't know. Uh, I don't know because I haven't seen other ones. I would give Sorry it to a, start. A, so far, this one's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> I would give this like I feel like an eight or a nine. Like I feel like it's good, and it was cheap. I love a bargain. I'm still wearing jeans underneath. Yeah, right. <laughs> you want water in the cold? I object. <laughs> what do we think, guys? By the way. I'm keeping with my theme of cheap outfits because these heels I got from a store called Windsor and they were on sale for $15. It doesn't look like a wedding dress. It doesn't look like a wedding dress. It's pretty dressed though. That made a wedding. Really? It still doesn't feel like a wedding. It still looks real not like a wedding. I give this dress a 2 out of 10. Yeah, two, 2 out of 10. You look great, but it doesn't look like a uh, wedding yeah. dress. It looks like a tablecloth. We're going like the Miranda Sings curtain for the next dress. Yeah. She's too big on me. You know what, I just need to show you guys how this is literally the curtains for my Miranda Sings old show, no offense. I would just like to point out, it's literally 
the exact material. And now I'm wearing it as a dress. <laughs> I would give this one a one. That made it worse. <laughs> I mean, I love a sparkle, but like, this is not a wedding dress. <laughs> a new ha. illusion. This one's gonna be rough. Handle that. This is for a sexy woman. But like, look, my boobs are going underneath the pads. Are you supposed to take them out? No, because there's nothing there. You can just see the full nip. Whoa. Okay, this, these pads are insane. Like, really? You couldn't even attempt to hide them? Like, this doesn't look like a wedding dress. This looks like something you'd wear underneath the wedding like dress. You're nursing a mother bride. This looks like you wear it in a shoe, right? Like this is a much yeah. dress. I mean, this is not good. Good. This is a zero out of ten. I like it. You like this? No, you don't. The boob pads are crazy. Like it's so insane. Yeah, without those. But then you just see my entire boobs. See that? That does. This is not a veil type dress. I think that's eating it. That's eating it. I feel like it has potential if this was. Not clear. like they could have done lace, but not clear, and then gotten rid of the boot pad, and this would have been kind of cute. Let's do the 50s dress. This one's cute. All right. Don't watch. I'm getting naked. See, this one could be cute. I like the idea of it. Like I wish this whole top lace gone. part was gone, because if it was just a strapless, I feel like it'd be really cute. Like I feel like we should rip this off. Do it. What do you think? It's much that I can tuck it. Mm -hmm. Poke you. Oh, there was the zipper. Anyway. Okay, we could always replace the zipper. Mm -hmm. I feel like this one is cute now. That's way better. Mm -hmm. What do you think? <laughs> okay. I would give this one a five out of 10. This one came really fast. This one was Amazon Prime, literally I think came the next day. <laughs> Finally! Lamp! Do you like lamp? Yeah. There's stains. Oh my God, so many stains, all the way down. Ew. It's all stained. Do you imagine if like, you were like, okay, this is gonna be my wedding dress and you got it and it was covered in stains? This is horrible. Love it. Is this your favorite? I really like it. Yeah. It looks like uh, what are they called? The fitted sheets that you put on a bed. It looks like it looks like <laughs> a fitted sheet. Looks like you made a fitted sheet. Okay, well here we go. What's happening? <laughs> this one is so bad. This is the worst. Well, I don't know if it's worse than the last one, but it's not good. We, first of all, it's supposed to be like really, really, really form-fitting until the bottom, and it's very loose. But well, why is the see-through part with the part under it shorter than? Because it's trash. What do you think, Corey? What if I spin in it? Yeah. That looks cool. Yeah. There you go. Just do that all night. <laughs> Oh man, I would give this dress a one out of 10. It's supposed to be a wedding dress? It was in the wedding dress section. It looks like an, like a grandmother's bath tile. You see that? You see what I'm saying? I see that. Like the same color too. Look, this one is not flattering. I feel like Layers. everything's in the wrong place. Oh, it gets worse as you look at it. Why does it look like this? I feel like, okay, first of all, it doesn't fit, so it's a little big, but like there's no way to cinch it, even if you could. This is horrendous. This looks like what Miranda would wear number one. If you have a figure, it will make sure to get rid of it. That's what this dress does. It's like, you got a nice figure? I'm gonna destroy that for you right now. Don't worry. We're going for stain next, guys. Okay, here we go. This is stain. Okay, there's a lot of things I have to say about stain. I have a little bit of a, a sentimental attachment to stain because of the fact that it has a sticker on it that says stain, covering up the stain. But also, look at the static electricity. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can hear it. I like this trimming. I mean, it's not the worst dress I've tried on, but it's certainly awful. What do you think, love? I love stain. You love stain? <laughs> okay, let's finish it off with the veil. And I even feel like we could do one of the belts with this one. The idea of this dress is kind of fun, but the execution is a huge fail. This is insane, the static electricity of this. Oh, oh, <laughs> 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 Ow, that shocked my vagina! I would have given this dress like a two out of 10, but because it just shocked my entire vagina, 
I got free laser hair removal, so it's a tie. <laughs> that was the easiest to get. What? This is kind of fun. You're a Justin. I feel like I would glow in the dark in this dress. This one's like, it doesn't fit me right. It needs to be a little like tighter. It's like baggy in areas that most girls have hips. I don't have those. Most girls have a butt. I don't have that. So it's like saggy in the area where most girls would fill it out. But I kind of like this one. I'd like you to fill I feel like Cleopatra. It looks like Bianca Del Rio made this up. Shade to Bianca Del Rio. What do you think, love? Do you like this Soft. One? It is soft. Do you like this one? <laughs> Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Compared to the other dresses. Oh, okay. A three or four out of ten. What do you give it both? Two. <laughs> okay. I'm not mad at this one. I like this. I think this is pretty. Wait, give me the little thin. This was supposed to be mermaid style, but it's not, because I don't have hips or thighs. Like, it's supposed to be tight all the way down to, like, there. But this one's not bad, actually. Like, this one should be tight down to there, but I actually like it better without that. That's a train. This one's kind of nice. I like this one. You like my dress? I'm gonna mama, is it pretty? This is sparkles. Look, Flynn, look, look here. I like this one. I think it's really pretty. I like that we started and ended with a bang. I feel yeah. like the first one was gorgeous, and I think this one's really pretty too. And it feels yeah. nice. It like feels like a good quality material. It feels like a good quality dress. Granted, the bow should be up on here, not down on my butthole, but this is pretty. I like this one. Yeah. This one might be my favorite. Yeah, I think it's mine. We ended with a favorite. Marry me. Come through Amazon. We had to go through a lot of duds to get here. But this is really nice. And it's not, it doesn't even look like it looks in the picture. In the picture, it's like an hourglass. It looks like that. You would have it like tailored though, right? When, yeah, when, if it was how it's supposed to be, it would be like that way. I'm just gonna like fit yeah. my body a little more. I love this dress. Say yes. Like Say yes to this dress. dress. Actually, it's not my decision. It's yours. <laughs>just tried them all on leave the comments below this has been so much fun I'm like obsessed with this so let me know in the comments if there's other things you think I should do this with I'm having too much fun though I don't even want to take this off I really like it but I also really want a Chick-fil-A sandwich so I gotta pick it up because I gotta go
my god you guys it's a couple days later and i just got the final wedding dress and it is wrapped in saran wrap this one is gonna be the weirdest like i don't know what's saran wrap and what's the dress <gasps> oh my <gasps> god i am not in the mood it's late at night i'm so tired but we gotta try it on before the video Is. Thanks for watching everybody. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Tell me what your favorite dress was, but also tweet me or comment on my Instagram and tell me what I should do next because this was so fun. I'm like sad that it's done. I'm like, what else can I do? Because this was so much fun. So let me know. Give me your ideas. I started doing this video because you guys suggested that I make a wedding dress out of JoJo bows and then it turned into this. So Give me more ideas because you guys are smarter than me. I love you. I'll see you guys on tour, MarinaSings.com to get tickets, and I'm not going to take off this dress. Goodbye.